We're talking baseball. Baseball! Nico right here. <laughs> Dustin right here. Hit, We're bi weekly baseball homer. show. Before we get into it, though, give him a little DraftKings info. DraftKings! DraftKings is the best daily. Sign up now using the promo code FST. Follow the link or the card. The card's going to be there. Link's going to be in the description. <laughs> and deposit at least $5 or more before the start of the NFL season. You get one of these. Not me, the shirt. Not, not a Dustin. And it will be black. And it'll be black, but you also get entry into a DraftKings contest that you can use right now for NFL or baseball. And if you're doing baseball, there's a lot of like guys to keep adding deeper leagues. They're perfect because they're cheap value. You put them into your lineup. And Dustin, I stuck a pick at his phone. He's got like three of these guys in his lineup that's going on right now. Money where his mouth is. I like that. All right, let's talk about Brock Holt. I am a fan of this guy. Here, let's talk about this first. First base eligibility, second base, third base, shortstop, outfield. How do you not get excited about that? Guy's hitting a ton of doubles. Ah, eh, you know I like me some doubles. And he's got, he can do it all. And he's only on 40% leagues. I don't understand why people aren't drooling over this guy. He needs to be picked up in more leagues. Could be the real deal. I love him down the stretch. All right, we're gonna talk about a Twinkie. So yeah. for the Minnesota Twins, we're talking about Buxton. He was called up earlier, and didn't do so well. And he hurt his thumb. <laughs> then he went, you know, then, you know, now he's called back up, though. That's the nice thing about it. And in the minors, he was very solid. About 300 at-bats, he had 30 extra base hits. And Dustin, what did extra base hits can turn into? Home runs. Eventually. 22 bags and batted over 300. So this is a guy that should be out. He's, he's, he's up in the bigs. He's going to stay there. He's got a lot of upside. Next, I want to talk about Dubo Herrera for Philly. Second base shortstop outfield eligibility. You know I like guys that can have you know, multiple position Clearly. eligibilities. Only on 40% of the leagues as well. You know, this guy's just not getting enough attention because he can do pretty much everything. I compare his stats to kind of like a Carlos Gomez, and a lot of people <laughs> picked him in the first that's round, great. which they shouldn't have. That's a dig at you, Gomez owners. You know, he's a guy that's going to give you, you know, just a good enough average, but everything else, and he's just not getting enough love. And his minor league stats are solid as well. This kid, real deal, I, I really like him. All right, got a starting pitcher, a young starting pitcher on the A's. That alone means you should pick him up because they just find these young guys. But Bassett for the, for the uh, Oakland Athletics, certainly a guy you should be looking at. I mean, he had very solid, I don't know why the hype isn't there, right? He had solid minor league stats. His kid K potential is very good as well. And like I said, it's a young pitcher coming up in the A's system. They always seem to end up panning out. So scoop him up for the last this last little run we got here. All right, let's talk about some people in deeper leagues. Nova, starting pitcher for the Yankees, guy I want to talk about. You know, he's not going to be an ace for you at any point. But the one thing I do like about him is in none of his starts this year has he given up more than four earned runs. So depending on your league settings, you know, he could be a good guy to have as your third, fourth, fifth starter. You know, again, depending on league settings, you get extra points for quality starts. You know, I like his chances for getting some of those down the stretch. All right, next guy I'm talking about is a guy that got a lot of hype before the season started, and that's Jackie Bradley Jr. So the Red Sox, it was crowded, so that was, you know, why he wasn't really up in the bigs, but yeah, playoff hopes? Not looking so good. Yeah, I'd say dwindling is probably the uh, a kind way to say it. So he's up. Now he's going to take some days off. I mean, that's certainly going to happen because it is crowded, but this kid's a, what we like to call in the in the, in the system, I guess. Dang it, I screwed it up. The biz. Five, the biz. I was looking for That's, biz. Looking for biz. We call him the biz, a five-tool player. This kid can do it all. It's time to take a look at him. A lot of Boston guys in this show. Next, we're talking about the Boston closer situation and Machi and Tazawa. It looked like Machi was going to be the guy, and then he's kind of stumbling. Now it looks like Tazawa is going to be the guy. It's a mess. It's kind of anyone's guess at this point. My money is just slightly leaning towards you know, Machi, but one of these guys will have value monitor this situation closely. All right, let's talk about guys to keep an eye on and more Boston guys. Why not? <laughs> Love some Boston this week. Uh, Travis Shaw, first base like for Boston. Boston. Here's an interesting thing about this kid. In the minors, he had about 300 at-bats. During that time, he hit five home runs. In the bigs, <laughs> he has about 65 at-bats. He has hit six home runs. So what? No, of course it does. Obviously, he's going to hit 50 this year. Oh, okay. No, it doesn't. He's going to come crashing down to earth. Dustin's <laughs> right. So keep that in mind. That's why he's only keep an eye on. He probably will come crashing back to earth. But due to this ridiculously hot start, you got to keep an eye on him. I mean, the kid's 25 years old. So that's keep the first an eye baseman on. for Boston. Now let's talk about the first baseman for the Yankees. The youngster, Greg Bird. Oh, Yankees win. 20, 22, that's what the guy does. 22 years old. 
and it's crowded there. He's not going to get regular at-bats unless there's an injury out there, but 22 years old, he's going to be good. He's a guy that, you know, the Yankees want to see what he can do, so they're going to give him some at-bats, but um, I, I just think he's keeping an eye out on him right now, but he could have value later in the year if there's an injury. All right, check out our app. We got our app up where you can pretty much a uh, good pen flip. Check out our app. Also check out Fantasy University if you're going to be drafting for football soon. we got all our rankings up, our football videos, DraftKings, of course. Twitter, follow us at Fantasy Advice. Facebook, like us. Circle us on Google Plus or Google whatever. And what else can they and do? And for the Fantasy Football University, we, you can get that on the Kendall app on your phone. Hey, you can get it on that Kendall that app. Was, that was a, flick it. Well, it was a different... I, I throw it all the time. I was trying, trying to, so far left.